first warning weather with meteorologist Andrew Grotsky. All right, let's switch gears and talk about the weather at 1216. Andrew, we have really mild temperatures in store. It is. It's a very mild day out there today. Yesterday was pretty nice for Super Bowl Sunday, yeah. around 40 degrees, some bright sun. Yeah, Felt it was great really nice. if you were doing anything outside, like going for a run, stuff like that. That's going to be the case for the next few hours today as well. So it'll be great to get outdoors and enjoy that. Right now at Stowe Mountain, some perfectly blue skies out there, temperatures in the upper 30s. A very pleasant Monday midday right now. And heading into this afternoon, those clouds will be increasing. We'll see some snow showers late. That could result in a few inches, especially in the mountains of the Adirondacks and Greens this evening through the overnight wrapping up Tuesday morning. But it's going to be feeling like spring, especially midweek on Wednesday and Thursday, up around 50 degrees, possibly getting into the 50s. But late week, we see a strong cold front, and that's going to bring us back to seasonable temperatures as we talk about late in the day, Friday and into Saturday as well. Now those temperatures right now, they are pretty pleasant across the region. We're in the mid to upper 30s for the Adirondacks in North Country, about 35 in Messina, 40 for the Champlain Valley for Burlington and Middlebury, and around 40 into the upper valley as well. So pretty mild day out there. We are mostly sunny as well, just a few high clouds off to the north, but those are going to build in heading later into the day. That's because of this area of low pressure in uh, southern Canada generating some snow showers with that cold front. That's going to work its way east bring increasing clouds and a few snow and rain showers this evening. But this afternoon, before all that gets here, we will see some sunshine for the next few hours. We're going to be pretty mild in the low to middle 40s for the Champlain Valley and even approaching some upper 40s heading into southern Vermont as well. Now we are going to be staying mild throughout much of this upcoming week and as we head towards Wednesday and Thursday definitely feeling like early spring with highs in the low 50s but notice Friday that cold air works back in we fall back into the 30s. So timing it out for you this afternoon we will be mostly sunny early clouds generally increase throughout the afternoon some of those snow showers break out across the north country in the Adirondacks and shifting into the greens heading into the overnight that's going to continue overnight into early Tuesday morning by 7 a.m. possibly a few mountain flurries lingering but generally drying out and seeing increasing sunshine throughout the afternoon on Tuesday and then clouds generally increase again Tuesday night. But in terms of how much snow to expect Monday evening through early Tuesday a.m., that's where we'll see about a dusting to two across the north country, perhaps over two inches in some of the highest peaks of the Adirondacks. Some totals over two inches for the northern greens and about a dusting to two into the northeast kingdom. And heading down the road to southern Vermont, some towns picking up over two inches for the southern greens. Tonight, temperatures are going to be pretty mild, holding in the low 30s in the Champlain Valley with some of those mountain flurries ongoing. Then tomorrow getting up around 40 with increasing sunshine. And as we look at Wednesday, it is going to be a mostly cloudy day, but breezy as well, turning mild with temperatures getting up around 50. And a few rain or mixed showers are possible early. Looks to be a minimal threat with a few more rain showers possible in the evening. But if you're looking for a more organized system, that heads in. Talking about Thursday overnight into Friday with some rain showers. That cold air works in on Friday, so we could mix with some flakes heading into the midday and afternoon hours. But looking at the next several days, overall, a uh, mild week ahead with above average temperatures getting into the 50s Wednesday and Thursday. Zuri?